Giving and sharing is deeply ingrained into my and my family's way of life. I feel very privileged that I'm able to give and that I have the opportunity to impact so many people with my gifts. My beloved husband, Jack, had a certain philosophy about life. One of his favorite quotes was by Winston Churchill, you make a living by what you get. You make a life by what you give. My parents really have ingrained in our entire family the importance of giving. My dad used to say something like, the more that he gave to charity, the faster his uh, pockets refilled. It would be hard to point out one aspect of Becky's life in the McCallum Theater, in the desert, in Rancho Mirage. It would be hard because she is selective, but she's broad in her base of giving. Becky is one of those philanthropists who changes lives in all that she does, from medicine to education and certainly the cultural community. The things that come to my mind are fun, beautiful, witty. She's a real leader in her communities. Becky is so connected to her philanthropy. Uh, she's very involved with the organizations to which she gives, and it's not just money, it's time. Becky is not just a patron, she is a community icon. She is what I would call the guardian angel of the arts in Seattle, and specifically for the Seattle Symphony and Benaroya Hall. The arts are really important for your health and well-being. Um, and there is where I think Becky's real gift lies to the community here in Seattle. I think the McCallum is a crown jewel of the desert. I've always thought that. We offer so many different types of entertainment, and I think it really brings everybody together. But it's the contributions that keep this place afloat. Becky's contributions to the McCallum have been so important, not just for the kinds of programs that we put on our stage every night, but also for our education program, which serves thousands and thousands of young people throughout the Coachella Valley. And I want to say thank you, Becky, and thank you to everyone who helps make the McCallum Theater possible. Back in 2006, yes, College Success Foundation, I was awarded a full-time scholarship to the University of Washington the impact that it had on my life is astronomical. One thing that separates Becky from other philanthropists is that she didn't just give her finances, but she gave her time. And time sometimes is more valuable. Becky, what an honor, 100 years young, and here you are celebrated again. Please know I love you, Becky, and congratulations. Becky, congratulations, and thank you for all you've done for all of us. This is a grand occasion to pay tribute to a very special lady. You've given so much to make life better for all of us. You know, being honored tonight, it, it's, for her, it's, it's fantastic. Um, and it, it's an honor for me to just be her son. Everybody's heard so many wonderful stories tonight about Becky. They're all true, no fabrications. She is everything everybody said she is tonight. Becky, you're such a special person to the McCallum Theater, and we thank you and we congratulate you on this evening. The McCallum Theater is my happy place, and I'm honored to have supported McCallum for so many years. Thank you so much for being here, and enjoy the rest of the evening.